Hey guys, today we're looking at an IN882 dimensional inclinometer from Kubler. Kubler offers inclinometers to track inclines in one or two directions and communicate that information to controls via an analog output signal or can open Modbus and the J1939 protocol like the sample we have here. These E1 and UL certified sensors use micro electromechanical system or MEMS technology with a mass suspended between twin capacitive plates. Tilting the sensor moves the mass and causes an electrical potential differential measured as a capacitance change. The MEMS-based IN88 is specifically designed to detect inclining and tilting of off-highway equipment and commercial vehicles. For example, to monitor the horizontal position of fire truck baskets and telescoping platforms, forestry vehicle levels, and tunnel and mining construction equipment boom elevation angles, as well as solar panel heliostats. This inclinometer tracks tilt angles to plus or minus 85 degrees in a wide range of applications. Because of its intended use outdoors, it has a robust build with a rugged aluminum housing IP67 and IP69K ratings, as well as an ability to withstand minus 40 to plus 85 degrees C temperatures. Shock resistance is to 100 G's and vibration resistance is to 10 G. Thanks to their flat construction measuring only 60 by 80 by 23 millimeters, these inclinometers are easy to mount and they can be stacked for applications needing redundancy for safety. So why use J1939 connectivity for IN88 inclinometers? Well, the Society of Automotive Engineers, or SAE, established J1939 to operate on the physical layer of high-speed CAN as per ISO 11898. It's primarily used in off-highway vehicles, powertrain, and chassis systems. Most communication is cyclical and accessible by all control devices. Parameter groups, or PGs, are optimized to eight data bytes for efficient use of the CAN protocol. J1939 CAN transfer diagnostics about temperature, motor speed, position, and much more. Decentralized networking sends channel-based messaging supports up to 30 devices per segment and 254 logic nodes. Information as parameters, or signals, is combined into PGs on four memory pages. For IN88 inclinometers, there are predefined PGs for position, speed, and alarms. For the inclinometers, SAE J1939 also allows programming of application-specific PG numbers, address claiming, LED-based status and fault reporting, and resolution of network address conflicts. J1939 also lets controls swap device addresses during machine operation. Speeds are to 250 kilobits per second with 29-bit CAN identifiers. Applications needing high data transfer can employ a broadcast announce message or BAM and connection mode data transfer or CMDT protocols. J1939 can transfer diagnostics about temperature, motor speed, position, and much more. Decentralized networking, sans channel-based messaging, supports up to 30 devices per segment and 254 logic nodes. Information as parameters, signals, is combined into PGs on four memory pages. For IN88 inclinometers, there are predefined PGs for precision speed and alarms. The J1939 compatible IN88 is just one in an extensive product line from Kubler, all with different connectivity and performance values. The IN88s maintain resolution to 0.01 degrees and plus minus 0.2 degrees accuracy in one dimension variations or plus minus 0.4 degrees from the two dimension sample detailed here. That accuracy remains stable over the whole life of the component thanks to the sensor array technique. For more information on this design, visit designworldonline.com or kubler.com. Thanks for watching.